Unido and STDF explain their value chain approach for SPS capacity building in developing countries. Anil owns a cinnamon production facility in Sri Lanka. He wants to export his product marked as pure Ceylon cinnamon, but faces challenges. There's a lack of skilled labor, and his product doesn't comply with sanitary and phytosanitary requirements. Now meet Sinali. She has been unemployed for a while and just can't seem to find work in her Sri Lankan village. She is even considering migrating to the Middle East. Is there no way to bring these two together? Yes, there is. The Standards and Trade Development Facility and the United Nations Industrial Development Organization use an intervention approach to meet SPS requirements through building food safety capacity. On the policy level, the private and public sectors work hand in hand, led by the SPICE Council of Sri Lanka and UNIDO. On the production level, UNIDO helps to develop a vocational training program based on food safety practices, delivered by the Cinnamon Training Academy. By modernizing obsolete techniques based on good manufacturing practices, Salon Cinnamon can meet the SPS requirements. Participating in the training, Sonali has soon acquired new skills necessary to work for Anil. Thanks to the skilled labor and upgraded production center, his product is now of much better quality. This means safer food and good business for everyone. For more information on the value chain development approach and how it can help you reach your goals, please visit unido.org and standardsfacility.org.